Hello, ladies and gentlemen, Sue me back, this time with something new for you. Katie, why don't you tell them who you are and what we're doing today? I'm Katie, I'm Sumi's little sister, <laughs> and we're playing TikTok, A Tale for Two. Okay, perfect. Now, what do you know about TikTok? Nothing. <laughs> Nothing at all. I've seen like two seconds of game footage of it, so I've kind of got an idea of what we're doing. Let's just hit the start button. So what I think we do is each select a character, a different character, I'll tell you what I'm picking, you tell me what you pick, and then we are going to give each other clues and stuff to try to figure out some kind of mystery. So I'll just go ahead and read what it's saying. This is a two-player adventure. Going solo is not an option. Pick a different player each and communicate to solve puzzles either in person or through phone call slash online chat. So basically what I was just saying, the game itself doesn't require an internet connection to play. For the best experience, don't look at each other's screens, but if you get stuck and need a hint, then it doesn't hurt to take a peek. So you can either screen share me on Discord if it comes to that, or I can just, like, low-key walk out there. And the last thing says you can click, drag, spin, and use the mouse wheel to explore the world. I don't see how we're supposed to spin, but that's okay. If you're calling through an online chat, we recommend that you use Discord, which we are. It's also a great place to find a second player if you need one. <laughs> TikTok A Tale for Two, a two-player co-op game played on two devices. Choose player. You want to be player one or player two? Player two. Lame. Okay, I'll be player one. You want player one? Uh, do I get to, like, type a name in here? Backspace? No? I guess I'm just player one. Make sure your team member is player two. You're player two, correct? Yes. Ooh, that was some lag. Okay, let's just hit start playing and see what's what. So on screen I've got Today you and your friend received two strange packages Each contained an old clock Is that what yours says? Mine says you received a package from someone called Emily Ran And your friend got one too Okay so it looks like right off the <clears> rip <throat> Our paths diverge a little bit Okay Okay, I'm staring at a desk that says Saturday 4-6-2019. I got a paper clip here, an eraser, and a little note. How about you? Same. Okay, my note says, Dear Player One, This clock is part of a game, a gift I made for my sister. <laughs> to have a fighting chance, play with a friend and tell each other what you read and see. If you find my sister, tell her I miss her. Emily. What's your say? Mind who, I sent one clock to you and one to your friend. If you want to play a game, look into the past together. Remember to wind the clocks up. Okay. I'm just kind of playing around with stuff. Okay, I can click the paper clip but not really do anything with it. Just okay, click. I can scroll down on the desk. Down on the desk. Okay. There's a box. Okay, I've got a box too. Mine has a little newspaper strip in it. It says, another disappearance stri, and it cuts off there by Mark D. Hansen, the youngest member of the renowned clockmaker family, Lerk? I think that's Danish. I don't know how to pronounce the A-E together. Lerky was reported missing yesterday. Her sister, Emily, told us she had last seen her at 10.30. Okay, well, I also have a newspaper article, but mine has the other half, and so I think it says, Strikes Our Village. Okay, so... Understandably distressed, she Sorry. Oh, my bad. So, another disappearance strikes our village is the whole line there. Go ahead and read it. Understandably distressed, she later corrected her statement and said it must have been an hour and a half later. Contact. If you have seen or heard anything unusual, please contact the police. Okay, so mine says 10.30. I also have the date. Oh, okay. What's your date? Tuesday, March 14th, 1937. 1937. Okay, we're in the past quite a ways then. So mine said 10:30. You're said an hour later. So we're looking for 11:30. Uh, I can't scroll sideways. Only up and down. I have a stopwatch that has a crack in it. Uh, same. Mine doesn't have a crack though. It says Emily 1915 on the cover. What about yours? Mine says Lark 1917 to 1937. Lark, is that, does it have like a weird AE letter in it that's not English? Uh, yeah. Okay. 
the younger youngest member of the renowned clockmaker family lark so lark is the last name or lark or whatever it is so emily lark or whatever it is i think so i'm thinking we probably just need to like oh wait. what's that i can move the i can move the uh, clock the hands i don't know if that has anything to do. yeah is there like maybe a code or something i don't know uh, it said wind the clocks back, and then mine said 10.30 was the time she disappeared. Yours said an hour later. So I think we need to, like, set it to 11.30. But that's not doing anything. Unless the small hand is supposed to go here. 11.30? Uh. We're supposed to go here. Let me try. Oh, oh, spin the thingy at the top of the, of the clock. 11. Let me spin it. Am I supposed to put it to 1130 first? I think so. What's going on here? I hear people walking in the background and stuff too. It's strange. Does it have to be directly? Because I can't move it directly. I know. I'm trying to figure this out. Um. Uh, lefty Lucy, righty tidy. <laughs> okay, so, okay uh, so go left uh yeah i think i'll try spinning it right make sure you got it set to 11 30 right so the small hand is between the xi and the xiii and the big hand is on the vi yes <laughs> okay now let's both Wait, can i like flip it upside down but it might not work because it has a crack in it, so I don't know. Uh. Do I have to like press the or something? No, I don't know. Wait, I want to read this again. <clears throat> Wait, what time did yours say? Your newspaper? Mine said it was at. It says her sister Emily told us she had last seen her at 10:30, and then yours said understandably distressed something something. An hour later, so 11.30 is the time we're looking for. Okay, it's an hour and a half later. An hour and a half later? Yes. Okay, so that would be exactly 12 o'clock, so both hands on the 12. Oh! Oh, oh. 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 <laughs> okay, so I did a, a thing. Okay, so you got sucked in too? Well... Our teamwork is something to behold that took us a lot longer than it needed to, but it's all right. Chapter one. This is a copy I made of the world that we're going to call him Lark. Actually, I can't in good conscience call him Lark. We're going to call him Lark. World that Lark and I used to know. Okay. Chapter one. Lark went missing in 1937, but it all started years before. 1937. Okay. So we're prior to World War II here. I'm gonna click the arrow, and it's counting back years. Yeah, we went to 1927. Hey, same. I see a bus station. Well, train stations. Okay, wait. I think this is. I think this is a bus station. Uh, clocks showing. Oh wait, there's a there's a train crossing spot up there, but this looks like a bus stop here. Uh, I got a little machine here. What is What the? I don't want to mess with this. Weird. We're missing a button. It's gonna. I can't. Yeah. Maybe it's like. Um. Okay. Well, let's find the button oh God, first, I guess. I went to a house. Wait, what? Which direction did you go? Oh. Right. <laughs> There's a jack in the box. Yo, this is some. Sp Spooky stuff here. There's a well. I'm feeling a strong ring. But whoa! Oh, I thought that rock had a face. Whew. I'm getting spooked. I don't know how to. Work a jack -in you don't know how to what? Work a jack in a box. Oh, I think you like wind up the little side thing, and then it eventually like pops out. So I'll go to the house That's where what you're I'm doing. at. Uh, okay. Wait, what? So, 
Whoa, 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 okay. Wait. So the house I went to has like a little toy train looking deal here. Oh, oh. It's got like a little toy train thing and I just wound up the wheel after I turned the light on. So the light puts some words on the screen and then the little train thing, now it's shooting steam out and I managed to get the whole message. It says, Lyric, I hope you like your present. Turn it anti-clockwise three times, clockwise twice, anti-clockwise twice, then keep turning it clockwise. Oh, and do not let go. Maybe it's talking about your jack-in-the-box. So That's it says, what I'm thinking. Okay. So anti-clockwise three times, make sure you don't let go. So. One, two, Clockwise twice. One, two. Anti clockwise twice. One, two. And now just keep turning it clockwise until something happens. It says, don't let go. Oh, it opened. Hey, and we're got... geniuses. Oh, okay. I got half of a train ticket. And it has like the little pattern on it for the like little game thing. Ooh, I'm... okay. Fancy. Can I like take it? <laughs> uh, maybe. You can also type it in Discord if you want. Oh, I'm in a well. Oh, I'm so spooked. But I can't type. It's like a pattern. Uh. Actually, yeah, I could. Okay, three up, four over. Okay. Hang on. Let me do it real fast. I've got a different little something going on here. Okay. <clears throat> I've got like a different little puzzle here okay, too. But I think I need to find the solution for it before I can do anything. It's like two or three across, two down. It's like a little thing that has a switch on the side and it's making a little pattern of like a triangle, a circle, and a square. So if you see anything like that, let me know the solution. I'm gonna go back out of the well though. Wait, I see a square and a triangle thing because I went into the well. I did too. Oh, you know what? Uh, which ones of yours do you need to press buttons on? Mine is one, three, and five that I can't, that I don't know what they are, but I've got the answer for two, four, and six. How about you? Wait, what? <laughs> so yours has like six different squares on it, right? That have shapes inside? Yeah. Does the top middle one have a button for you, or is it locked in place? It's a button. Okay, so that should be a circle that's hollowed out, like a circle with white in the middle. Switch it to that. Okay. Okay. The bottom left one should be a square with white in the middle. A square with white in the middle. Okay. And the bottom right should be a circle that's completely dark. But before you hit the switch, tell me what numbers 1, 3, and 5 are. Like the top left, top right, and bottom middle. The top left is a triangle that's, like, blacked out. Okay. The top right is a triangle that isn't blacked out. Okay. And the bottom middle is a square that's not blacked out. Okay, let's hit the switch. Hey. Ooh. Did yours open too? This? That's the uh Yeah, the, I got the button we're missing for the thing at the trains at the bus station. Oh, okay. Okay, we are most certainly cooking with gas now. There's a Raven's clocks here. Do you have that too? Yeah, opening hours three to nine. Okay, I can't go. Opening hours three to nine. Wow's though. So that's more or less pointless. Oh, time is passing. I'm going to butt. So it's two o'clock now okay, if you see wait, the clock. Up. Okay. So for the first half of it, I don't have the second half. Four. Okay. Oh. Yeah, you're right. I'm missing something, too. Maybe I'm a fool. 
Let me go back in the house real quick and see if I can find any information. Wait, how do you know what- oh, okay, there's a clock. Uh... Hmm. Does this mean anything? Uh, I don't think it does. Yikes. I'm going back in the house. Okay, yeah, see if you can find anything else in that house. I'm just gonna look down in the well one more time and see if there's anything down here. No. I don't... I can't move anywhere. We're missing half of the ticket. Well, I can mm. definitely mess with the shrubbery. You can click the bushes and they go rustling. Oh! Did you I'm find something? Like... No. I just didn't know you could do that. <laughs> I see. Um... I hear a lot of footsteps. Hmm. I could just try guessing. It's kind of what I was doing, but... Up three, over four, down two, then over one. Wait. That I know. Wait, 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 what was that? Okay, so the train thing? Yeah. The first half of my ticket said up. It said what? Sorry, you cut out. Over four. Up three. Okay. Over four. Mm hmm. So you should be like, okay, so one, two, three. And then from that third one's one, two, three, four. Right, and then down two? Yeah. Okay. And then over one. And then over one, and then that's all you've got? Yeah. Let me just type that last one over one in the Discord. Uh, okay. So... Well, what the heck does that, <coughs> does that mean? <laughs> I don't know, man. One, two, three, one, two, three. I'm gonna try to figure it out. <laughs> mm. Try to find more. Try to figure this out. Although it might be on my side. Dang it. Okay, hang on. <laughs> I'm just gonna go around and check. Like all the like bushes. It's, it's gotta have something to do with. Oh! Oh, it looks like enough time has passed. Okay, we just had to wait. The clock place is open now. It's not for me. Oh. I already checked this. No, I didn't work back in the house. Okay, so... I'll just tell you what I've got going on at the clock place. There's a radio on the front of it, and if you adjust it, you get a couple of messages. First one says, last month, the police started getting several reports of pets going. And it cuts off there. Let me just get find the tuning for the next one. Then we've got, the oldest raven daughter, Emily, is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps, and then it cuts off there. What the heck is this thing? The Raven family moved here a month ago and they've worked day and night. Okay. Another. Oops. Another pet has been stolen during the night. This time it was Miss Jensen's. A strange occurrence has shook our village. Droves of lifeless. <laughs> Excuse me? <laughs> I'm the one who shook. What's. One more message, I think. No more walking for five miles to get your letters. It's now March and V. Oh, bless you. And it cuts off. Bless you again. Thank you. How do you feel knowing the whole world's gonna hear you sneeze? 
<laughs> and nice. the, last, the last one says, an unusual white raven seems attached to the youngest member of the... And that's where it cuts off. Oh. Wait, a white raven. Okay, wait. So whenever I, like, pan around to the house, white raven, like, flies down, but then it flies away. And then I tried clicking on it, but nothing happens. Um. Does it lead anywhere? I don't. I don't know. I'm going places, like random places. Well, there's a cuckoo Both clock directions. at the top here. What's going on with this clock, though? There's like a little bug Wait, on this Wait, now I'm seeing it. Now I'm seeing it flying like the trees and stuff. Huh, wait. I'm like wicked hard confused right now. Wait, it was on top of the... The clock place. Wait, okay, it's three. I can go in now. No, I can't. What? That, that says three o'clock. Let me in. <laughs> Raven family moots. Okay. At one point, a little bug came down the stairs that was like a wind up toy. Oh! Oh! I can keep going up. Okay, I'm going. Okay. Um. Okay, so I'm in the clock shop. I'm gonna tell you what my radio says. Okay. It says, are you are usually followed by the ticking and scuttle of one of her. And then it says, nothing. Letters are scrambled. Same with that one. You gotta okay. tune it to the right place. Like, that just means it's almost tuned. Oh. Sweet old farm dog, remember to lock your doors until this thief has been caught. Construction of our very own post office will start at the end of the month. And then, the raven... Okay, let's hope for her sake that it will not go missing like those other pets. Some old cats and dogs. Let's hope they are all found soon. Strange. Whoa. Okay. Clocks. Um. I have a question for you. Okay. So, at the doorway, on the top, it says, for me, it says Priva, and then it gets cut off. Do you have the other end of that? Wait, say that again? So at the top of the doorway to the stairs? Oh, I'm pretty sure that says private. But I have private as well. Oh, you, okay. you can like keep scrolling up. Like above the, uh, there's like a calendar up here. The calendar's gotta be the key. It says the end of the month. Um. There's feathers. Feathers. Maybe to the white raven. I've got like a little rolled up piece of paper I can't do anything with. But there's a, there's a calendar up here. Sunday, Monday, I have two. Tuesday. Huh. I have two white feathers, maybe from the white raven, and then I have a news article and a window. The news article says, Wednesday edition, in Raven's Clock Shop you can buy all kinds of clockwork, request commissions, and get your old clock repaired. Today, grand opening of Clock Shop, the world renowned Clockmaker, Mr. Blank. The level of detail is exquisite. Uh, our own Raven has opened a new clock. Queen is said to have a couple of his of his our our is said to have a couple of his our tan. He is said to be an interesting blank, elegant pieces. Today is today he is opening his blank. Hmm. Huh. 
It's just like cut off a lot. Hmm. So I can like wait, move wait. this. Wait, so on your radio? Oh wait, I can move this calendar down a little bit. On your radio, what is the first Wednesday? Uh, the very first one is around the 525 hertz mark. It says, last month the police started getting several reports of pets going... Dot, dot, dot. Going missing. Mostly old cats and dogs. Let's hope they are all found soon. Okay. Okay, mm. second one. Second one says... The oldest raven daughter, Emily, is a brilliant clockmaker and inventor. Her footsteps... Dot, dot, dot. Um, her footsteps are usually followed by the ticking and scuttling of one of her creations. Okay. Next one says, The Raven family moved here a month ago and have worked day and night, dot dot dot. You'd be able to open their clock shop today, the eight, the 18th. Okay, wait. To be able to open the clock shop today, the 18th. Okay, keep that in mind, 18th. Okay. Another pet has been stolen during the night. This time it was Mrs. Jensen's dot dot dot. Sweet old farm, farm dog. Remember to lock your doors until the thief has been caught. Okay. Next one is... A strange occurrence has shook our village. Droves of lifeless... Birds have been found scattered across the forest floor. Ooh, okay. And then I've got... No more walking for five miles to get your letters. It's now March and V... Dot, dot, dot. Construction of our very own post office will start at the end of the month. Okay, so March. And then the last message says... Oh, if I can get it. An unusual, right, an unusual white raven seems attached to the youngest member of V... Dot, dot, dot. Raven family. Let's hope for her sake that it will not go missing like those other pets. Okay, so we got a couple of dates here. We're in March. This yes. is March 18th. So, can I get to the March 18th? Here, I'm gonna write it in Discord. And then it also says at the end of the month. Okay, so I'm at March 18th, which is a Monday. What does that do for us? And then the 30... There's 31 days in March, right? Uh, 30 days, April... Yeah. Okay. Okay, nothing's changed on the outside. Whenever I did March 18th. Let's see what happens at the end of the month. Okay. Ah. Okay, so set yours to March Wednesday the 18th. Set what? The clock at the very top. Hey, I've got it. Okay, I got the other piece of the puzzle. Hang on. Um, clock at the very top. I feel like I was getting... I don't have a clock. Okay, so this, one is, this one's just on me. So what I've got here is... Uh, how am I going to type this to you? Over one. Up. One, two, three. Over two. Up one. Over one. So this is what I have. Oh, God. <laughs> so the little arrow, like, I'm using uh, greater than as, like, a right arrow, and then the carrot key is, like, an up arrow. You know. Can yeah. I, can I do anything with this stuff? Gulliver's Travels, okay. Longitude? Hmm. What the heck is this? Okay. Well, we know the key to the puzzle, so I'm gonna go back out real quick. Hmm. Are you sure yours was up three and not up two? Um, I can go back and check real fast. So from the starting, 
Okay, yeah, it's up to you. I was counting the starting block at the Yo, your boy's brilliant. Yeah, okay, I'm confused. <laughs> up Here. one. Or over, okay, over one. Up three. I just snip Three. Okay, I got it. Train. Yeah. <clears throat> okay. So, I don't know at what point my mic just muted. I think it was whenever I control V'd in that solution. So that's the solution that I just sent you. Uh, a train is here. We're on chapter mm -hmm. two. So we're going to go ahead and stop here and just jump right into recording the next one if you're okay with that. Okay. Okay, cool. So thanks for watching, everybody. Hopefully you enjoyed that. Make sure you like if you like. Subscribe if you want more of our questionable puzzle-solving skills. Take care, everybody.